Number 10. Everything Everything, directed by Stella Magai. Combining the best from The Fault in Our Stars with a smart and affecting tale of interracial relationship struggles, Everything Everything follows Maddie, who is smart but suffers from an illness that prevents her from leaving the house. But love calls when she and the neighbor's boy form a bond through their bedroom windows. Where would you go if you could? The ocean. The ocean? Why? Number nine. There's a lady. She's just like you, kind of beautiful. Where Hands Touch is a romantic war drama film written and directed by Ama Asante. Exploring a heartbreaking interracial relationship from a historical perspective, Where Hands Touch sets its themes during World War II, where a young teenage girl, daughter of a white German mother and black African father, meets a member of the Hitler Youth. Forming a bond that goes beyond the strict social norms, they are forced to witness the horrors that surround them. Aren't you afraid? Of what? Fighting. War. Does the war frighten you? Yes. My father fought in the war. He did. Number eight. Just doing a final pass. <clears throat> and then what? And then I'm gonna head into uh, an agent that Professor Wallen recommended. The Words is a mystery romantic drama film written and directed by Brian Klugman and Lee Sternthal. Not only poetic, but thrilling through a smart concept, The Words is an inception-like representation of the world of novels. When a wannabe writer finds a stranger's unpublished novel in a lost bag, he publishes it under his own name and becomes famous. But what follows is a passive-aggressive war between him and the real author, as well as a mysterious third party. What do you think of it? I think it's old. I think it's great. I feel like if we clean it up, you can use it for work. It's yeah? classy. I'm gonna get it for you. Number seven. Thank you. Thank you for explaining. Not simply disappearing. <laughs> Quite understand. A United Kingdom is a biographical romantic drama film directed by Ama Asante. Defined by great acting, craft, and a true life story to enchant your hearts, A United Kingdom explores the interracial drama confronted with racism and hate from an unexpected perspective. When the Prince of Botswana falls in love with a white woman from London, their bond shocks the world. But in time, the two can hopefully prove that their relationship is stronger than conventions. I don't think you do understand. I, I don't know what happened tonight. But I do know that I would hate to walk away from you here in this moment, knowing that I wouldn't see you again. Number 6. The Hate You Give, directed by George Tillman Jr. This surprising breakout turn from a young and talented lead cast explores cultural clashes in modern communities, as well as one of America's greatest issues. Constantly switching between a mostly black neighborhood and a wealthy white prep school, young teen star must choose a side when she is confronted with a great tragedy. You are acting a damn fool if you think I'm one of these little thirsty girls running around here that you can hit. Star, you're not. You're way more important than that to me, okay? We've been dating for almost six months, and if you can't tell that by now, then I don't know what else you want me to say other than I miss you. Number five. How, how nice to see you. And you, Miss Lindsay. The British drama by Ama Asante is inspired by the true story of Dido Elizabeth Bell, the illegitimate mixed-race daughter of a British aristocrat. The film shows Bell's efforts to fit into society, but her skin prevents her from fully participating in the traditions of her social status. Left to wonder if she will find love, Bell meets an idealistic young vicar's son, and together they seek to end the cruel practices of slavery in the 18th century England. What of your mother? I know very little of her other than the color she has given me. Well, then at least you know she was beautiful. Number four. Waves, written and directed by Trey Edward Schultz. This subtly crafted family drama explores a generation's ups and downs through the eyes of an African-American household in the suburbs. Taking a closer look at modern black culture and the difficulties of growing up as people of color, we are taken on an emotional journey weighted by the loss of loved ones and the consequences of unprocessed trauma. I know you're under a lot of pressure right now, but I'm just getting really scared. 
Oh, what? What's, what's going on? You okay? Number three. The Big Sick, directed by Michael Showalter. This cleverly put to film exploration of cross cultural themes and hilarious rom com humor proves that there is still fresh air in the genre's typical tropes. We follow the adorable Pakistani Kumajil, who deeply falls in love with an American student. Concerned about what his conservative parents will think, Kumajil must find a way to win her parents' hearts as well as remaining in his parents' hearts. Yelling anything at a comedian is considered heckling. Heckling doesn't have to be negative. So if I, if I yelled out, like, you're amazing in bed. <laughs> That'd be a heckle? Yeah, it would be an accurate heckle. Number two. Audit. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. Why don't you come back with me to my place so we can sing? That's not a good idea. Mm -hmm. I don't know about you. What do you know? I know you're trouble. <laughs> <laughs> well, <the> vintage. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> are you Tell serious? me. So you mean like, uh, Jess is a hard worker, honest and prompt. I believe she'll be a valuable asset to your team at Sizzler of San Bernardino. <laughs> no, not a reference, you dick. <laughs> Criticism, constructive criticism. Number one. Supe desde la primera vez que escuché tu voz. Como si hablaste a una parte de mí que ni yo mismo conocía. Como un hechizo. Palm Trees in the Snow is a Spanish romantic drama film directed by Fernando Gonzalez Molina. A beautiful mixture of adventure and romantic drama, Palm Trees in the Snow is the story of a young and beautiful woman who finds a tantalizing clue in an old letter. Now smelling the fresh wind of mystery and adventure, the journey to her family's tropical plantation will hopefully uncover generations of secrets buried beneath time. Do you